everyone and welcome back to my channel. If you guys are new, my name is Kate and welcome back to another productive day in my life. Today I have a lot of stuff to get done so I figured I would film it for you guys. So yeah, anyway, this morning I woke up at 6am so bright and early <laughs> and yeah, Justin was still sleeping so I decided to go and edit the video that I filmed yesterday was which was just like a healthy like day in my life. Justin and I went and played tennis and just did like a bunch of stuff. We did a grocery haul and all sorts of things. So I'll leave that in the description below if you guys want to go watch that. But yeah, I decided to edit that. And usually I only post like Tuesdays and Fridays, but I am trying to post Tuesdays, Fridays and Sundays now that school is done. But then I was like, you know what? I'm just gonna post it today, which is Wednesday. So I just figured like I'd throw in an extra video for you guys. So now we have four videos this week instead of just three. So yeah. Anyway, that goes live in literally half an hour, so I'm gonna go work out in that time. And yeah, what else did I do today? Yeah, woke up, edited, had some breakfast, went for a walk, just that kind of stuff. Just like a good productive start to the morning. Um, yeah, so anyway, I'm gonna go work out. For today's workout, I'm actually gonna start the Chloe Ting Summer Shred Challenge for 2020. It is four weeks. I don't think I'm gonna do the whole thing, and I don't think I'm gonna vlog it or do what I did the last time with the two-week challenge. This I just wanna do because, you know, her workouts are really good, and obviously, you know, they really helped me in the two weeks that I did do them. So I'm gonna start with day one, and I'm not gonna do the optional like warm-up routine or anything like that i'm just going to do the full body workout and the shredded abs so that's what i'm going to do so this is what it looks like so that is what i am doing today but yeah it is like a really long program it is just like four weeks of complete workouts but yeah i just want to do them because they're really good i'm kind of just alternating between the chloe ting workouts and pamela reef her workouts are so good and she has an amazing body like amazing so yeah i just want to do that as like a nice little workout this morning and yeah let me show you what we have on today's agenda so as you can see i have my to-do list written here this to-do list is inspired by lauren doan i will leave her channel in the description but yeah she's one of my youtube friends and yeah she's a really great girl she's super sweet and she does the most amazing list but hers looks so much prettier and more colorful than mine but i just wanted to like write this list and usually i would do it on my phone but today i just feel like it's sometimes nice to just be able to actually take things off and my like journal or diary or whatever it is is just like super messy right now so i wanted to do it on this page instead so already woke up an hour earlier than expected I had my breakfast, so now I'm gonna work out. Um, I have an interview today, so I'm gonna be prepping for that as well. Um, I have to organize my desk and my bathroom. The drawers are just like disgusting. You know, after like a semester, you just have like random pieces of paper in your desk. So yeah, I wanna like clean it out and throw everything out. Um, I have my interview at 2 p.m. today. I need to go to Staples to print out some labels and I have to return all my textbooks for the semester. I wanna get some editing done for this video. And then I'm gonna be calling one of my friends, Sydney, who also has a YouTube channel. Yeah, she's like really sweet and I wanna just talk to her about like this um, thing she does on the side. Like she does social media for companies on the side. So yeah, I just wanna like talk to her and it'll be good to just like catch up because we've never actually like facetimed before we've only really spoken through like instagram and stuff like that but i'll leave her channel in the description below she's also like really sweet she's a college vlogger and yeah her major is so cool she does social media so if you guys are into that i'll leave it in the comments uh, <laughs> i'll leave it in the description below but yeah anyway i'm gonna go work out and i think by the time i finish working out my video will go live and then i'll probably just like spend that time just like replying to comments from you guys and just making sure that i like promote it on my other social medias so with that all said let's go work out <laughs>
Hey everyone, so it's been a few hours, so let me just update you on what I did. Um, yeah, so I worked out, I showered, um, I just blow dried my hair just so it wouldn't be wet for my interview. Um, did some makeup and kind of just prepped for my interview and I think that's really important to do. So I wanted to like talk to you guys about usually how I prep for an, for an interview so that way if you guys have any upcoming interviews, you know, maybe this can help you or something like that. So usually I just take like a bunch of like notes on everything and I really just do like just like a lot of preparation so like usually what I would do is I look at the company's website you know I read you know what they're about like when they started um, I look at all of their social medias um, especially because I'm marketing um, maybe you don't need to do that for the, for other companies but that is usually what I do I kind of just look at yeah just like everything they do what they need to improve on that kind of thing and then I also look into the job posting so the position I applied for I look at all of the like bullet points of like the roles and responsibilities so I go and look at all of those and just kind of think of ways that the experience I have either from you know you know past job experience or school experience or just even like you know my own like YouTube and social media and stuff like how I can fit in my experience into what um, they want me to do <laughs> so obviously because this is like a marketing job and social media um, I need to take a look at all the social medias I've done all the positions I've held in school organizations that my college has that kind of stuff so I usually do that and then I go through like a bunch of questions like I think about pretty much all the potential questions that they could ask me and think of what my response would be or like what experience I have that I could prove that I have like leadership experience um, and just that kind of stuff and then go through <laughs> like my strengths and weaknesses um, and just kind of have like answers prepared um, and then with that another thing I always seem to be getting like I seem to get this question a lot when I like go for interviews is just like you know a time where something went wrong with either like a customer or just something that didn't go your way and like how you dealt with it I always have an answer for that um, another one is like why you so like why you for the position over like someone else so like reasons why you would be the perfect candidate um, compared to someone else applying who maybe has like the same degree as you or qualifications or something like that um, another thing that I always prepare for is like why you are interested in this line of work and obviously like why you want to work for the company so that's another one and then I always have a bunch of questions listed so that way when it comes to them asking like what questions do you have for me you have a bunch ready to go and I think I just went through everything that I normally do so sorry if that was like a bit of a jamble but like my notes are kind of all over the place because that's how I like take them for this so yeah but anyway, I just like to be prepared and just think of like potential questions that they could possibly ask me and just like that kind of stuff. And then I also just like to have a little section like, like I guess if I was employed there, like what would I do differently? So there's a few things that I would like to do for this company um, and like some advice, especially in terms of like social media for them as well. So I want to like, you know, speak to them if the opportunity arises and that kind of thing. So yeah, that is how I prepare. <laughs> so yeah, anyway, it is almost half an hour till my interview. So I'm gonna go and put on a business shirt and just kind of like prep myself like mentally because I always need to like be in a good state when I like have interviews and stuff because I do get kind of nervous for that and think anyone would get nervous, that's normal. But yeah, anyway, I'm gonna go do that and I will check in with you guys once I'm done with the interview. So wish me luck. <laughs> Hey everyone, so I finished my job interview. It went really well. The guy that was interviewing me was so nice. Like it was such a casual conversation and we just kind of spoke about like what I would be doing at the company and like how I would improve like their social media and that kind of thing. Cause that's one thing they want to do is like really kind of revamp their whole like social media and just their like presence as well and just build brand awareness and that kind of thing. So. Anyway, it went really well and yeah, I just hope something comes from it um, with this whole coronavirus thing. There's just been so much uncertainty lately. Like I've had, like I already got two internships for the summer and now it looks like I might not have any, but then now 
I interviewed for this one so we'll just see I should know within like a week or two I think he said so yeah we'll see but anyway that went really well and then Justin and I went on a little walk just to get some fresh air and everything like that now he's in a conference call and I have just been looking at my to-do list and so what I think I'm going to do is organize my the my part of the bathroom cabinet because it is really messy. So I want to organize that. I can't organize the desk drawer just because Justin's in a meeting so I don't want to interrupt him. And then I think after that I'm going to make a quick staples run. I already sent the packing slips over to be printed so they just need to be printed. And then I'm going to go to UPS and FedEx just to like return all the textbooks for the semester. And yeah, that's kind of what I have planned to do right now. So I'm going to get to organizing. made a really simple dinner for tonight just cooked some pasta and then used what sauce butternut squash pasta sauce so I'm excited to try that I've never tried that before and then Jay just topped it with some parmesan cheese so looks good <laughs> say hi <laughs> Hi. this is Sydney the girl I was telling you guys about go subscribe to her <laughs> oh, <thanks. laughs> Hey everyone, so I feel like every time I vlog and actually talk to the camera, I've been sitting in this room today. It's just kind of how it's been. But yeah, it is 7.30 right now. I just got off my call with Sydney. She is literally the sweetest person. She's so nice. I will have her channel below. And yeah, it was just so good talking to her. We just kind of spoke about social media, like strategies. She's done social medias for like other companies we were just kind of like talking about her experience wow I have mascara here <laughs> that's a look <laughs> so yeah we were just kind of speaking about her like past experiences and that kind of thing and then just like catching up on like life and everything and it felt it just felt so nice to speak to someone and like just like FaceTime and yeah anyway it was a really good conversation we spoke for like an hour so anyway I will show you guys my list so we had a pretty productive day. So I pretty much did everything on my to-do list. Like I worked out, I prepped for my interview, I organized the bathroom. I didn't get around to organizing my desk, but I'll probably do that tomorrow. I had my interview, which went really well. I went to Staples, I returned my textbooks. I did not edit, but the only thing I had to edit was this video and I'm probably just gonna edit it tomorrow morning. And yeah, and then I called Sydney. So a pretty productive day in my books. The main thing I just really wanted to do was just really just prepare for my interview and just do it. And it went so well and I'm so happy with that. And yeah, anyway, I feel like I had a really productive day. So thank you guys so much for coming along with me and just watching me have my super productive day. But yeah, anyway, I am gonna go shower now, take off this little bit of makeup that I did. And yeah, and then I'm just gonna chill and probably watch TV with Jay. So yeah, that's all for the vlog. So yeah, thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you all in my next vlog. Bye guys.